All right, so we are here at the Holiday Inn in Bensonville in Chicago, Illinois. This is kind of a uh, unintentional overnight layover here in Chicago. So since I do have a room for the night, I want to give you a quick tour. Now, of course, we're starting at the door. Have your fire map safety information, peephole, well, that's two light twitches here, which turn those off for a second. First one here turns on this room, and then we'll turn on the light in the other room. We'll get to that in a second. Now, keep in mind, this is kind of my first impressions as well. So, um, like some of my other tours, I have not actually stayed in that room. So, let's see what we've got, shall we? Start with the bathroom here, and it's pretty nice. Walk in shower with looks like they actually got a shampoo, conditioner, and shower gel in the little spray canister so you don't need bar soap, which is nice. Uh, shower is pretty decent size. Um, for someone my height, it's actually at a good height. It's kind of a shame I'm not going to really be able to use this room for anything really than sleeping in. Because so far, First impressions are, I mean, this look pretty clean, pretty nice. Now one thing I did see here, um, between the throne and the sink is they have a little divider. So I guess if you're traveling with somebody, I don't know, if they walk in on you, they can't see you, but that's kind of a nice little touch. Um, a little Kleenex box there, and of course your um, bathroom amenities. And then of course the other switch here, it looks like, oh, there's actually a vanity light, that's nice. So that's pretty cool, yeah. As we continue in, we have a little kitchenette here, it looks like, microwave. Let's take a look, looks pretty clean. Coffee maker, ice bucket, there's a couple little coffee things down there. Um, little Keurig stuff here, it's kind of cool. Um, and I'm guessing, it, and we have a mini fridge down here as well. Darn, nobody left me anything to drink. Oh well. Um, if you come in here, a little closet with an ironing board. It's a little. Um, there's no light there, I don't think so. Um, it's a little hard to see. I don't know if. I'm kind of looking around here as I'm filming to see if there's any other lights. Maybe I can turn on. Here's a lamp. Uh, kind of helps a little bit. There we go, that kind of makes it easier to see in here. So you got an iron ironing board. Looks like you do have a decent, well, you have a handful of airs. I guess enough to get the job done. Um, looks like there's some space for luggage down there. Um, oh wait, what do we have over here? Um, not sure if that's like a luggage rack or the storage shop. But up here you actually got some hooks to hang stuff on, so I guess that makes up for the hangers. Um, and then of course there's some space underneath the bed here. Or not the bed, the, it's late, I gotta wake up at 4.30 in the morning, leave me alone. The shelf, yep. Of course we got a big TV over here. Um, and then it looks like a common, I mean a combination. Um, are they? No, they're separate. They're just, they just look combined. Combination, if you will. Uh, desk slash storage. Three drawers. Let's see. Pretty decent size. They smell new. So, they look nice. I mean, they kind of have that new wood smell. You know what I'm talking about. Good work desk. guys so um, if you're noticing a difference in the recording style I don't know what happened with my camera it just decided it was apparently done so we're gonna go ahead and pick up I don't know where exactly it stopped recording so we're gonna start over here with the TV kind of give you a look at the hooks as well so let's pan back over here to the desk just in case it got in because it looks like it's a decent size and a computer 
wheeled chair. Now, if it got in, oh, this mess, I work up on the wall, those and those and such, but I was messing around with the lamp. I wasn't sure how to turn it on, but what I discovered is, if you come in down here and touch this little touch thingy down here, you touch it, boom, the light comes on. If you hold on to it, it actually will dim the light and eventually turn it off, which is cool. Outlets over here. Let's go ahead and turn this guy off. Off. There we go. There's a little kind of couch over here. Let me see if I can figure out. There we go. Um. And then how do we do this? Well, you know what we're gonna do. There you go. Let me give you a little bit of a look outside the room there. And not really anything special to look at, it looks like. So sorry. Um, I guess this one must control this side maybe. I'm gonna go ahead and put this down, although I don't really think for my benefit it's gonna really matter. <laughs> because like I said, I'm out of here at 4.30 in the morning. <laughs> or I should say I'm out of here at 5 and I'll wake up at 4.30. <laughs> No, I'm looking forward to it. That's good. Just got to put down here. And the uh, heating unit kicked on. I think I saw... We'll go back over here. I think I saw a temperature control over here. Let's see what we're set at, shall we? It says 74, so it's on cool. Hopefully I got flannels on the, sh on the bed. I might be changing that. They did give me a king-size room, so... That's nice, like they give me plenty of room for the small amount of time I'm going to be sleeping in here, so, hey, I'll take it. Got a little table over here. This is the light that got turned on when we hit the switch at the beginning of the video. And then we have another lamp over here. With the switch that I'm having a hard time getting to, there we go. And then of course you got your phone down here. Oh, that's a clock. Um, wait. No, there's a phone. Hey, like I said, it's late. Leave me alone. <laughs> Couple plugs back here. So I guess if you do need to plug something in, there's also a USB charger. It's cool. Um, I might actually be using that. Maybe. <laughs> like I said, I'm only here for a couple hours. I don't know if it's really worth it. Probably not. Now, more important, most importantly, let's check the bed. Because this is important. Um, I haven't exactly done any checking of this hotel, so I don't know what kind of reviews it has. Pillar number one checks out, pillar number two looks decent. Um, I'll play a game of which pillow I want to use here soon. Um, let's see. The, ah, I'm not going to mess with that. The mattress looks good. Alright, cool. Um, yeah. Looks pretty clean. Alright, so this has been a quick look at the Holiday Inn Express, Benson, Bensonville in Chicago. I'm out of here at seven o'clock in the morning. Well, I'm on my flight at seven o'clock in the morning. I'm out of this hotel at five o'clock in the morning. Marvelous. So, from Chicago, this is Matt. Have a great night and have a good one.